think this is uh, the Lego City Police Dog Van. Some people say that it technically has four minifigures because of the two dogs. This is actually the only Lego City set that comes with two dogs. And number 4441, ages 5 to 12, 312 pieces. It's a building toy, of course. Easy start. Of course, Lego. The, the logo has not changed in about, well, it hasn't changed since they made Lego. Not that I want it to change. Numbered bags, of course. Somebody said, I figured out that uh, everything, at least everything that's at least over 10, or that are over $15 is probably about, probably has numbered bags. You get the robber. It's kind of like a small story. Car. And then they figure out and they're sending out the dogs. Then the dogs find them while he's about to get out. And they take them to jail. And then, like that, and then they drive off. No, we're done with this box. Two instruction manuals, one for the van and one for the robber. So, let's go ahead and look at the set. Okay, this is the set right here. First, I'm going to start off with the first thing we get to build. The first thing we get to build is this little car. You get a robber. Here. There's a dark gray pant piece and a little jacket with a police um um striped thing. And the robber face with the golden tooth and the black beanie hat. Okay. Okay, and you can go ahead and stick them in there. Like, and in, inside there, right here, there's a little bit of space right there where you could put a crowbar. Steering wheel. A nice. A nice motor sticking out of the hood. Oh, back then. A spoiler. And another spoiler, which doesn't really go through. I don't know why they even... They, it doesn't go through because of this little grill. I'm kind of like this. Okay. Like, like this. And there's some little bumper pieces. And wheel wells. So that's a pretty cool car. Now let's go on to the second thing we get to build. The gold mine. There is this little thing. I think they are... 
I think this little or yellow thing is either a bunch of bananas or a beehive. I think it's a beehive. Some bars. You can get the crowbar and kind of. Then you can kind of break off the bars here like that. And then you can go ahead and and you can go ahead and add some of this stuff right here. Looks like a piece came off. Um, there's a new piece. It's a circle piece, except it has the little bars, and it's holding these tree pieces up. On the back, it doesn't just, you don't just have this on the back, this part actually opens up. This part actually opens up, like that. There's some gold bars right here. It comes with a diamond. Yeah, like that. Okay. Here we go. And that's pretty much the gold mine. And plus it does have that sign. It's pretty much some eyelet pieces. That's pretty much it. Okay. Now, now let's get up to the good guy. Pretty cool. Now, this is a pretty cool vehicle right here. Let's go ahead and take off the top. Just pretty much has a police. Just says police and some cool lights up there. Lots of lights on this vehicle. On the inside you get a police minifigure. Let me get his hat back on. Fell off. <laughs> um, dark blue pants. A tan torso with some badges, some pockets with, with, uh, it actually has two walkie talkies, one on this side and one on the other side, you can't really see it, but anyways that's the police guy, has a nice cozy chair with a steering wheel. Go ahead and place my guy back in there. You do get, I've only seen something like this in the Lego, well actually this is my first one, in the Lego Car and Cavern, it's a, it's like a different thing, it's more, it's at a different angle, it's steeper, then and there's also studs all right back there. And it's pretty cool. I got a tiny Rooch here. Eh, I'll get rid of him after the review. Go ahead and take it off. There we go. There's a big sticker right here. I don't know why they didn't just make a blue one. Because those wall elements are actually white. I don't know why they didn't just do a blue one if the sticker was still going to be huge and blue. There's a police sticker and some little windows. You can see the dogs. And on the other side, you still see the windows. And right here... There we go. And you can see there are little bars. 
And then you could go ahead and open this side up. And you got the little ta two dogs. Right here, you have a gate separating them. Like this. Printing on the dogs. The dogs are pretty cool. And you could go ahead and place the dogs back. And there's some little slanted pieces. Then Then a little jail right here. Go ahead and open it. And right here, you could set the Robert here. Okay. And you also, and you also have the set number right here. Also have the set number and some smooth plates to top it off. And on the front, it's pretty cool. Some little, some, some little bars right there, and some lights. Okay, well, as most of you know, well, if you're watching this on the day I post it, you probably know that it is two days till Halloween. And you may have noticed I'm wearing my eyeball ring. So, I hope you are liking this review and I hope you well I hope you say what you're gonna be for Halloween in the comments I'm gonna be the Lego Ninjago J I'm not gonna post a video I'm not allowed to show my face I may be able to do it sometime but okay that was just a quick review on the Lego police dog van I'll have more to come soon.